Who do I accept right now as we welcome the Republican nominee, President Trump, and the Democratic nominee, Vice President Biden? <laughs> I will tell you very simply, we won the election. Elections have consequences. We have the Senate, we have the White House, and we have a phenomenal nominee, respected by all, top, top academic, uh, good in every way, good in every way. In fact, uh, some of her biggest endorsers are very liberal people from Notre Dame and other places. So I think she's going to be fantastic. We have plenty of time. Even if we did it after the election itself, I have a lot of time after the election, as you know. So I think that uh, she will be outstanding. She's going to be uh, as good as anybody that has served on that court. First of all, um, thank you for doing this and looking forward to this, Mr. President. I, uh, the American people, have a right to have a say in who the Supreme Court nominee is. And that say occurs when they vote for a United States senator and when they vote for the President of the United States. They're not going to get that chance now because we're in the middle of an election already. Election conditions. As far as the say is concerned, the people already had their say. They... Okay, Justice Ginsburg said very powerfully, very strongly, at some point, 10 years ago or so, she said a president and the Senate is elected for a period of time, but a president's elected for four years. We're not elected for three years. I'm not elected for three years. So we have the Senate, we have a president. It's elected to the next During election. that period of time, during that period of time, we have an opening. I'm not elected for three years, I'm elected for four years. The and the hundred million started. people, Joe, the hundred million people is totally wrong. I don't know where He knows that uh, what I proposed. What I proposed is that uh, we expand the world care. And we increase it. We do not wipe any. And one of the big debates we had with 23 of my colleagues trying to win the nomination that I won, we're saying that Biden wanted to allow people to have private insurance. Still. They can. They do. They will. And in my proposal, not what you said, but and it's not what you said. That is simply.